Hello my friends, welcome back again to the Daily Dose and in today's video we've got some news and updates from Hot Wheels, Majorette and a lot more so kindly stay tuned and watch the remaining part of the video to find out what beautiful cars are coming soon but anyways uh, before we proceed I'd like again to remind everyone to stay home and be safe okay so let us move on right now with our news so first up here this is the uh, upcoming 2020 mainline Hot Wheels Corvette C7R so this is a beautiful car here so the C C7R is always was always and has always been <laughs> a beautiful casting from Hot Wheels and this one right here has a lot of tempos speed patrol on the side and next up we got the 68 Shelby GT500 in white so I'm really happy that they made this in white right now I love white cars although some some of you might find white uh, plain and boring like a Toyota Corolla <laughs> but yeah it works for a lot of cars including this uh, 68 Shelby right here and this one also has flames on the hood on the side and going to the back but doesn't have front and back tempos so quite understandable because of all the flames here on the body and by the way ooh, before we move on this one has red tint on the windows kind of cool right there and uh, from Majorette let's uh, let's take a look again at some of their new cars here the new Mercedes-Benz G-Wagon and their Lamborghini right there the G-Wagon has opening parts again so I think they have improved on this one uh, slightly because the previous one the previous release uh, yeah, it has an opening hood but it just opens at a really, really small angle less than 45 degree I should say but this one right now based on the picture it has a much bigger angle on that so yeah, pretty good stuff I think they also improved the uh, wheels here new design but if I am a uh, mistake if I am mistaken kindly comment it down below and here is their new Lamborghini here another beautiful piece with opening features so you can actually see some engine details on the back so pretty neat cars here from Majorette and some more Hot Wheels 2020 main lines coming soon so check out this black 69 Ford Mustang Boss 302 so a beautiful casting I always love the uh, Ford Mustang Boss casting this one has some uh, green accents uh, on the car like this one right here on this part of the hood and the green uh, lip on the wheels so beautiful car here although this doesn't, this doesn't have front and back tempos wait wait I think I'm mistaken it has front tempos here but doesn't have uh, tail light tempos well, anyways still a really beautiful car from Hot Wheels always love again the Mustang Boss casting and some minifigures here from Corvette a bootleg uh, Lego brand here if you like the Black Widow set so check this one out they have one coming soon this is the Black Widow set here featuring the Red Guardian the Taskmaster, we got Black Widow and I think the white one here is Yelena Bolova, not really quite sure but yeah you can comment down below and uh, this one right here I don't know why they included uh, this Captain America Bucky looking like figure but yeah not really familiar so far with the upcoming Black Widow movie so you can comment down below and uh, next up from Jada Toys, this is their Fast and Furious custom Peter Belt coming soon. So this is available for pre-orders on some Facebook uh, sellers. So beautiful piece here. Hot Wheels also had a uh, Peter Belt casting way back. If you remember that one, so really glad that Jada Toys has a custom Peter Belt. So here it is, out of the box. Yeah, really looking good love the chrome accents on the car here on the uh, truck and here is again 
some more pictures of it yeah just gorgeous uh, custom Peter built from Jada toys and from tiny you got two cars from tiny here the first one we've got the Toyota high ace UPS so this is a UPS van here now some uh, my uh, some point here about tiny a lot of the cars remind me a lot of Tamika cars all but just a little more upgraded version of the Tamika like this one the Toyota Highs it really looks exactly like a Tamika uh, casting well except for the wheels here but of course Tamika doesn't have a UPS steam uh, van so but this is a really good car here by the way and what really uh, reminds me about Tamika uh, when I talk about tiny is yeah like this one here the opening features really looks like what Tamika has right there on the hinge but yeah beautiful piece here from tiny and another one from tiny we've got the mini Cooper mark 1 in red here with some uh, roof rack here and the bike so the bike I think yeah it is not detachable but this one has three opening parts so can you guess what the parts are and uh, some more angles here really beautiful chrome here on the front details on the tail lights some silver accents here even the wind windshield the wiper has some silver accents right there and the back part too is again detailed so all important parts of the car uh, is detailed so yeah these are the opening parts the two doors here the driver's side and the passenger side door doors open and the hood opens so you can actually see the engine details here it is a beautiful piece here so really love the tiny mini coopers they have a bunch of them so you can check the one out in the web page and here is the uh, majorette five pack here vintage rusty gift pack hosted by collector's passion so let's check out the car here i think it, yeah i've featured this one already in my previous video but this is a new picture a much more clearer picture of the cars in this vintage rusty gift pack so let's check out the cars again we got the toyota celica here this is a beautiful uh, car i think this is my favorite in this set because i just love the toyota celica my second favorite actually is the renault 5 here not familiar with this one it looks like a uh, a uh, ford uh, what's that kia i mean wait kia and ford were the same kia Wait, I, I actually forgot the exact name. It was a 90s Kia that Jay Leno had and Jay Leno, Leno, Jay Leno featured in his channel. So it kind of looks exactly like the Renault 5 here. So beautiful Renault 5. We got the VW bus. We got a Mustang here, which is also a beautiful car. And we got this Beetle again. So Majorette has a lot of variations, variants of their VW Beetle. But yeah, really loving the Celica, the Renault 5, and the Mustang here for this gift pack, rusty gift pack from Majorette. And then here is something new. Uh, first time I have actually heard of this brand here. This is from Load King. So you can actually Google Load King diecast. The first result is their web page. Yeah, so they actually got some uh, trailers and some flatbeds for sale on their web page kindly uh, google their web page uh, this is the link here or you can, you can just google load king die cast and the first result again is their uh, official web page so here is it again really beautiful piece here this is a 164 scale model of this peterbilt trailer right there and then some matchbox here matchbox 9 pack found by ig Madicast. so beautiful cars here yeah the i featured this one already but those were really uh, pixelized photos so 
here are some uh, some more really uh, clear photos of it so yeah we got a Porsche we got a police car really beautiful we got Mini Cooper and a bunch more we got an Alfa Romeo here this Alfa Romeo is really beautiful as well and another uh, nine pack here another Porsche we got a Holden here we got this one here the VW Golf is always present in multi packs from Matchbox so beautiful cars again just showing you, showing you guys clear photos of it and from C2 here this is a 150th scale model of the BMW i8 so this is the uh, version of the BMW i8 and it looks beautiful right there so the uh, rims here are not die cast metal it is plastic as you can see but the body here is die cast metal this is slightly bigger than 164 scale and has opening features as well so you can actually see some caliper details right there which is kind of neat here it is again here's the front view of the car so gorgeous gorgeous cast casting here from Siku and it has some plate number details engraved to it so kind of neat details right there they just uh, they didn't just paint the plate number but it is part of the molding details on the body here it is again interior interior photos so really neat photos here details on the dashboard yeah really beautiful stuff and some more stuff here from Siku this is their Bugatti Veyron set so this is set number seven I have only seen one a set here in in my in the Philippines I think that was uh, two years ago and I haven't seen one again so three color variations of the Bugatti Veyron so this first Bugatti Veyron here is gray with some green accents, green colors. So really not liking the wheels on this one actually. Kind of kind of bad looking wheels. It has some uh, front details. I think this one doesn't have opening features. Not really quite sure though. And I don't like the space here between the uh, rims and the fender. It's weird out of proportion and here is the convertible again kind of high profile on this one I want this to be low on the ground but the front details on this one is kind of cool here's a third one reminds me a bit of what Hot Wheels had before but does it, I don't like the rims on this one again so this set actually is kind of disappointing but anyways let's take a look at some more details of the car here the interior deal is good at least details on the back is pretty good oh so the, the uh, this one has opening features the gray one so yeah all three have opening features here's the uh, convertible the different interior details here and here is the last one yeah so overall I'm disappointed with this set but still it is a Bugatti so I think this will still be uh, hot in the market so anyways that is all for our news for today I hope you enjoyed this one if you did please smash the like button comment down below your favorite cars in this video and your opinions on the cars in this video and subscribe if you haven't yet join the family by subscribing and also watch my other videos I have a lot I upload every day <laughs> I have fun uploading and uh, yeah stay safe again bye bye peace out and enjoy the rest of the day bye bye guys